Yo, so how's it going guys? Welcome back to another GTA 5 video. So as I'm sure you guys are aware, over the last few years, I've loved to show you guys a ton of awesome clothing glitches that allow you guys to acquire rare clothing items that usually you can't buy in the game. These have included rare military outfits, policeman outfits, trashman outfits, plus much, much more. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys something pretty awesome, and that's how to save the medic outfit from the new Doomsday Heist. As you guys can see, it is one of the most detailed and awesome looking outfits that we can currently get in the game but not only that you guys will be able to get up to four different variations of this medic outfit so i guarantee there'll be at least one medic outfit for all of you guys so as always if you guys do enjoy this video and, and you would like to see me cover more epic glitches like this in the future all i ask is to drop a like down below and if this video does do well i'll definitely be sure to post more videos like this in the future without further ado let's get into the video Okay, so the great thing about this glitch is it is extremely easy to do. I guarantee 100% of you guys watching this video right now will be able to come on straight away and do this in your very first attempt. Now, to acquire this outfit, you guys will need one friend or one other player or yourself that owns the facility so we can launch the brand new Doomsday Heist. So if you guys don't own the facility and you don't have any friends that do own it, just leave a comment underneath this video and say, need player with facility, followed by a PSN or your game attack, and I'm sure you guys will get a ton of replies i've got tons of helpful players in my community always up for helping each other out however what you guys want to do is go ahead and launch act one heist mission one so it is called the data breaches and you basically want to get the mission right here called the dead courier so the prep mission for this is basically just to pick up an ambulance very basic and very straightforward stuff so it shouldn't take you guys more than 10 minutes to reach this point in the video now you guys will notice when you launch this mission you can be on one of two teams now you guys obviously want to be on the paramedics team and as you guys can see what i said earlier on there is four Four different versions of this paramedic outfit that you guys can get so just simply go ahead and select the one that you guys like the most now when you guys launch the mission you basically want to ignore the instructions of getting in the ambulance instead you want to get in your personal vehicle and you want to make your way over to any of your own departments in the game so make sure that you guys do head over to an own department in the game and not an office or a facility or a bunker this will only work if you guys head to an owned property so i'll fast forward the gameplay to save you guys time Time, but as you guys can see i finally arrive at my apartment the eclipse towers once you guys arrive at your apartment you simply want to make your way into the wardrobe and then you guys will notice it won't allow you to save as an outfit but instead what it will allow you to do is apply a mask over the outfit so simply go ahead and select any mask in the game that you guys would like on this outfit as you guys can see i end up going for this like green Halloween skull mask which I think looks pretty good with the paramedic outfit now once you guys have equipped the mask you want to back out of your wardrobe and simply go ahead and just find a new session or quit the mission now as I'm sure a lot of you guys are also aware these new heists are very very dodgy with like connection issues and being glitched out so what may happen to you guys is what happened to me and you guys will notice this I was loading on this goddamn menu in the sky for a full-blown five minutes <laughs> yes you guys heard correct five minutes i'm just gonna fast forward this gameplay so as you guys can see i was literally stuck on this screen right here this usually shouldn't happen when doing this glitch this never happened to my friend he was able to spawn straight back into a free roam session so basically what should happen from here if you guys are lucky enough not to get these goddamn connection issues with the heist it will spawn you straight back into free roam wearing the paramedic suit now personally i don't have the patience to sit here and look at a clifford advertisement in the sky for over 10 minutes so i ended up just dashboarding the game now the great thing about this glitch is if this happens to you and you have to dashboard out of the game or in other words i know you can't dashboard on playstation you have to restart the game then what will happen is you'll still spawn into free roam with the paramedic outfit and i will prove this to you guys in just a second but as you guys can see the gameplay in the background is times four speed so imagine this in normal speed how long i was goddamn waiting for this glitch to work however as you guys can see fast forward in 10 minutes i lost my patience pull up my interaction menu and just quit the goddamn game nonetheless as you guys can see once i restart the game i spawn straight into online my character is still wearing a paramedic suit and from here all you guys have to do is head straight over to your ward 
wardrobe and then go ahead and save this as an outfit. And in all honesty, I was still kind of shocked that my character was still wearing a paramedic outfit. Mentally, I prepared myself to do the entire glitch again. So it is good to see that the glitch does work even if the servers are playing up. Rockstar Games really need to sort out the servers with these brand new heists. I'm pretty sure all of you guys have already experienced it. If you've tried to play these heists, you'll just end up loading for ages on end. However, the final part for this glitch, the easiest part as I did mention, all you have to do is go back into your wardrobe and simply save this as a brand new outfit and you can switch through different outfits and you will always have this outfit remaining and i will prove this to you guys in just a second so as you guys can see i end up calling my outfit para short for paramedic however as you guys can see i'm able to flick through all of my outfits and once i arrive back at the outfit it should still be there by the way if you guys do like the look of any of these outfits you can see on screen leave a comment down below and i'll link you straight to the video of course as of right now if you add the duffel bag onto any of these outfits it will freeze it so you basically can't flip through your outfits you have to go all the way back to your wardrobe to select your outfit again which is quite annoying i'm pretty sure there will be a workaround with a duffel bag in the next week or so so stay tuned for that glitch coming very soon nonetheless that is going to do it for me guys an absolutely awesome clothing glitch allowing you guys to acquire the rare paramedic suit after all the latest patches on ps4 xbox one and pc if you guys are still watching to this point then it's more than likely you have enjoyed the video so all i ask is you return the favor by dropping a like down below and i'll definitely be sure to post more videos like this in the future nonetheless that's gonna do it for me guys and i'll see you in my next video peace